Now before we get started, be sure to check if you have any allergies to petroleum jelly or fake blood. Um, for the scar putty, you will need a 2 to 1 ratio of petroleum jelly and flour. You can also add foundation to match the skin tone you have. Um, you, and if you don't have petroleum jelly, you can also use Vaseline, uh, whichever you have access to. Also, be sure for the fake blood that you do not get it in your eyes and on your clothes because it will stain. Now once you have applied the four scar putty bite marks, uh, apply foundation around the area. Uh, for this, you can use the basic makeup routine of foundation, concealer, translucent powder, and don't forget the contour. Once that is done, we can start applying shades of black, brown, and gray eyeshadow to appear that we haven't slept in days, assuming that the Five Nights at Freddy's 4 character hasn't been able to sleep due to the nightmares. And also, be sure to blend well. Now going over to the bruise wheel, I will be adding some bruises and cuts to the face, neck, and scar putty. When applying to the scar putty, please keep in mind, start from the edges and work your way to the center. And be sure to blend it out as best as you can. It doesn't have to be perfect, but line it out as it would be a natural bruise. Since the bruise is so large, it's due to the giant impact on the forehead from the bite itself. So keep in mind, for the impact damage, there will be a bigger bruise than what small impact would inflict. Now what I'm doing is doing some finish touch-up lines on the contouring and adding in some more cuts and scrapes from what he probably had inflicted from the bite mark or from the nightmares. When adding the fake blood, be sure to be sure not, I'm sorry, be sure to not get it in your eyes. Jeez, we don't want it to get in anybody's eyes. Um, yeah, do not get it in your eyes or on your clothes because it will stain, so please keep that in mind. Um, Thank you. 
If you do happen to recreate this look, please tag me on Instagram. I would love to see what y'all have done.